you have full flexibility in creating content statuses so you can align them with your document review workflow steps. Give them a name and definition. Choose a color and an icon to represent the status. Use statuses across spaces and across lifecycle configurations. Different types of documents, different content management rules. It means that the same status can have different criteria for different types of documents. Add a new status easily to your content status scheme and define the status using Confluence query language. Your pages or blogs are automatically classified. Assign content to their owners or define who should be notified. Send email notifications to users so they can review their content on a predefined schedule. The job audit log preserves all app activity for audit and compliance purposes. The log makes it easy to verify all past events, their exact time, actor, and results. Every job saves a different type of app activity data. The content status overview is available for all Confluence users, not just admins. It's an overview of all your spaces, with the number and ratio of pages in each status. Filter the metrics by content status scheme. Content type like pages or blogs. Or search for a specific space. You can also find out the status of individual pages. Find the content status indicator at the top of each page. If it's gray, it means status hasn't been calculated for a while. Click the status to refresh it. Edit this expired page's content. The status is now updated.